Hiya folks, so today's battle is short and sweet and so I'm going to get right down to it. This is a random Wi-Fi match using my doubles team uh, and my opponent is leading off with a Smeargle and a Haxorus. Yeah, Haxorus. Uh, proof in form that Nintendo knows nothing about the uh, competitive Pokemon community because hacks obviously does not mean the same thing to them as it does to us. Uh, speaking of hacks, yeah, so Dark, Vo uh, Dark Void on Smeargle missed both of my guys, which you know what, I am not sorry in the slightest because Dark Void, that's a dick move, man. Uh, pardon my language, little kids in the audience, but it just needed to be said. Anyway, his Hexorus went ahead and used Dragon Dance, um, which turns out to have been a bad move, considering that I'm about to set up Trick Room with my Gallade, and um, Rotom uh, went ahead and uh, Blizzarded and hit both of his Pokemon. Another little bit of hack, since it's very unlikely that Blizzard will hit both Pokemon in a double battle. Um, but yeah, uh, it takes uh, Haxorus down to its sash, and so unless he's running priority move, which I don't think he can learn, um, yeah, that's it. So anyway, Gallade goes ahead and uses a uh, super duper 4x effective fire punch against uh, Durant, and that's enough to take it out. And then I go ahead and use Discharge on Rotom, um, because Gallade uh, actually has the same defensive stats as Gardevoir. People don't really realize that. People think of Gallade as frail and Gardevoir as not. But they have the same stats except for the attacking stats. Um, but so yeah, uh, takes that uh, to discharge like a champ, and I'm gonna go ahead and call it back at this point uh, because there's no sense getting more damage on. Um, and Lantern is going to be able to uh, take on this uh, Charizard, which is his last Pokemon, uh, no matter what. So anyway, yeah, here goes a discharge, which is going to you know recover any damage that Lantern takes, although he has no damage now. I'm really surprised that didn't Oko. Uh, kudos to the person who raised that Charizard. Very impressive. Um, but anyway, uh, Charizard goes ahead and uses a boosted Heat Wave uh, with a Fire Jewel? What's it called? Heat Jewel? Anyway, it's enough to take out Rotom, and it's enough to do a decent chunk to Lantern. Um, but, you know, this battle's over. I've still got plenty of Trick Room left, and, uh, you know, Lantern can KO him with Boiling Water, which is 100% effective. Um, and, you know, I'm sending out Steelix now as my fourth. Steelix is the slowest thing imaginable. And so I have Steelix use Rock Slide um, because I'm actually hoping for the miss and hoping that Lantern's actually going to get to do something in the, this match. Alas, no such luck. And Charizard goes down. And so that's the end of the battle. Comment, rate, subscribe, and challenge.